So this exercise consists of a little three jump gymnastic and five other jumps. So it won't take forever to set up, but it rides as a nine jump track. It's awesome to do just before a show, which is exactly what I did. It has all the turns and related distances you'll need to practice and the gymnastic rides a bit like a combination, so there's that as well. It's a really cool little exercise, even if you don't have any shows coming up. Okay, so here's the setup. There aren't a lot of jumps, but you jump a few of them twice and a lot of them are related, so you'll need to get it right. The order I set them up is the easiest way to do it, so try to do it this way as well. So let's start off with a little gymnastic along the top long side of your arena. So it's a vertical, one stride to an oxa and one stride to a vertical, with poles as tram lines to keep your horse traveling straight through it. These are the measurements. So from the first vertical to the oxa, it's seven paces. And from the oxa to the second vertical, it's seven and a half paces. You then add the tram lines for both one strides. Remember to have them at least two meters apart. You don't want your horse landing on them and hurting himself. You then set up this line down the bottom long side of your arena, oxa to vertical. It rides down on five strides, so it walks 24 paces. You then set up a vertical at an angle like this. It's a related distance to the oxa in the line you just set up and also rides five strides. So it walks 24 paces on a curve to the oxa. Followed by a vertical at an angle like this. Quite close to this oxa because you still need to squeeze another jump above it. And finally, an oxa at an angle like so. This oxa is related to this vertical on a curve. It's a six stride related distance, so it walks 28 paces. And that's it, you're all set up and ready to go. We set this up completely differently to the way you ride it, so be sure to watch how I ride it or you might get lost. Don't forget to download the JPEG of the course plan so you can set it up off your phone. Uh, the link is in the description below. Okay, so the first little hairpin turn looks a little more difficult than it is. It actually rides quite well. My little nutter wanted to jump these two jumps, which was the most tricky part for me. <laughs> also, try keep your step coming out of the corner. That will give you a more forward ride to the oxa, which is always nice. Exactly the same applies to these two turns. However, these two jumps are entry points to related distances. 
So if you're quiet into these jumps, the related distances will ride long. Now that's not the end of the world, as long as you realize this and are quick to react to make up the ground you lost due to the quiet rides into the related distances. Awesome, you made it to the end. So you're the type of person that will really enjoy this channel. So if you haven't subscribed yet, hit the subscribe button and I'll keep the videos coming.